Country's falling apart, yeah, but who knows apart. what happened? Who knows what it'll be like in two weeks? But anyway, fuck all that. What we're here to do today, and what we're here to talk about today, is the bitch is back. What kind of yeah, is it? Mm, the yeah. Hillary Clinton story. But we'll get back. No, we'll get into it. Not the Hillary Clinton story, but we'll get into like I was gonna give some. I don't yeah, know what the fuck well, I'm saying, um, dude. Some, some, I edited some. fucking Ron Coons for twelve fucking hours today, man. My brain is fucking cooked. Oh, yeah. You brought this upon yourself. I know I did. I 100% and know I all this did. pain that you're taking. Me. Yes. Nobody. All this, Nobody this else. It's all me. You Why? Well, I, I don't fucking know, dude. I don't know. You like pain. I guess I still kind of feel like I owe Rod something for all the horrible, horrible things we've said over the fucking Maybe years. Maybe you wouldn't mind getting Kathy Bates. Yeah, I wouldn't. By Ron? Yeah. By Ron? Yeah. Because he you know, really wouldn't have any strength and he's to old hammer as it fuck. off. Yeah. And he'd, drink, he'd be like, ow! But he wouldn't break it. He'd be like, eh. <laughs> He'd fall over. He'd be like, oh, dude, no. I don't like it. It's still weird touching you. I don't like it. But um, I'm pretty clean. I'm static -y clean. I mean, I know how to look at it. <laughs> no, he'd be like fucking um, Texas Case on Basker. Remember when they give Grandpa the hammer? And he's like, meh. And it just falls out of his fucking right, head. That was basically <laughs> me. <laughs> but anyway, this is from 1995, and it's from the Netherlands. And the first thing we see is a dude coming. Yes. Oh. Uh, uh, uh. into, into a, a doll. Into a sex doll. Yes. Let him blow up one. And then he just fucking kicks it across the room, and it's all tied up, and like, I, I, you know. Why do you feel the need to tie up your sex? And then kick it. Yeah, and then kick it. I mean, it provided, it did what it was supposed to do. Yeah, it, a weird, squeaky hole, it I guess. It provided you whatever you needed. <laughs> but that's like, I, I don't get it, dude. I mean, sex dolls? Do you really, I mean, do you really need? I mean, I'm pretty sure we've talked about flashlights before. About how I think they're fucking pointless and just use your goddamn hand like you people are doing for <laughs> millennia. But, like, sex dolls, that's just fucking weird have, all around. Have you noticed some of the dudes that do crazy shit? The way they look, they're all wide-eyed and stuff. They Women need the sex dolls. Shit. I'm talking about every white dude that, that shoots some place up. You know, you ever notice it's always a white guy and he's always wide-eyed and crazy. You know, yeah. like Sandy Hook dude, he was all wide-eyed. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm saying that these guys could probably use a sex doll. Maybe they wouldn't be so help, like bent up and shit. Yeah. You know, come well, I mean, box. That's kind of like the cure for everything, really. Yeah. Dudes just need fucking laid. Is that, you think that's it? Dude, like fucking terrorist bombings and stuff, dudes need fucking laid. Fucking right wing extremists that fucking hate everything, they just need fucking laid. Incels definitely need fucking laid. Nah, those fuckers, I don't think it matters how much they get laid. You well, know, they don't they get probably, laid because they're incels. Probably been fucking their sisters for years now, and it hasn't never. Wait, you're not talking about incels anymore, are you? I'm not talking about incels. What the fuck are you talking about? What were you talking about? <laughs> I was talking about incels! Well, that's okay. Oh. They're not porking anybody. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, everybody needs laid. Everybody. Hey, what's that PCU? Uh, everyone gets laid. Everyone gets laid. Well, that would be my platform <laughs> if I became president. Like, everyone gets laid. And you would win. Ma I probably would. <laughs> Marijuana. Good. <laughs> <laughs> Red one is not even a thing anymore. It's not going to be a thing. Oh, fuck, you know? dude. Cop pulls um, you over, hand him some. He probably you know, needs it, too. You know, the only thing we've talked about was dude coming into a doll already, right? We've already just been all it's over your the place. Life, you're, we're talking about your life history here. A guy comes into a doll. No, I've already said that I think fucking anything that's fucking like that is fucking pointless. 
Coming into a dog? Because then he's got extra work to do, dude. You can just come into, like, you know, a napkin or fucking anything and just throw it away. But, like, you gotta fucking clean a doll, dude. Or a flashlight or any of that stuff. That's just more work. And you already feel fucking shitty after you're done fucking jerking off. You're like, oh, I'm a filthy fucking monkey beast. You know? Monkey beast. <laughs> I never feel guilty, but I, I, get, I guess people do. How would you consider you know? But like, you're like, you're like, well, to be like, you filthy monkey beast. But, like, yeah, you know, how fucking fucked up would you feel? Like, you know, you're already, like, guilty for jerking it, like some people get. But then you gotta sit there and do the wash of shame. Where you're washing your fucking sex doll out, or you're fucking it with a cup, pressure cup. washer. <laughs> but anyway, dude goes over to the two glasses of wine he has set up for him and his sex doll. For the cum cup. And drinks them both. That's why I call flashlights, because like they are basically, basically a cum cup. Like, you basically just on an assembly line making them like, Are you done with those cum cups? Like, almost, sir. We got about 50 ship. We need about 100 more cum cups. Hey, Bob, how's them cum cups doing? Cum cups coming up. Good. Dude, I bet they call those fucking bits in fucking flashlight cum cups. <laughs> if not, they fucking need to. Anyway. They're like, what about the butt nut? Dude. The butt nut's coming up two thirds. Dude gets in the fucking shower, so he's uh, trying to wash the ugly off. It's not fucking working. It's not. Really. So, you know, you get the psycho shadow in the fucking shower curtain. Right. And then, you know, of course, it rips open. The doll says this. Here's Lorena! The doll speaks in nothing but movie lines. Right, right. Nothing but movie lines. Yeah, which was kind of creepy. But and then she's creepy all together. I just don't like the way dude, they look. Dude, she's way creepier than um, she doll sex, sex doll she bitch. Yes, yeah, she. Which is. I say saw this and was like, hey, we can one up this, and they kind of did. But this is fucking awesome in its own I don't way. I don't know why we gotta one up it. Like, why can't like, you? Know, I can't take it. <laughs> but anyway, dude gets stabbed in the fucking arm. Effects look decent enough. <laughs> she pulls it out. Yeah. Tries to stab him again, and he fucking Dude. backhands the shit out of her. Seriously, like, you know what I mean? He couldn't do some jujitsu type shit and grab the scissors off the fucking thing and be like, pop, pop, pop. But what's pop, funny pop, 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 is, well, it's not funny. What I think is funny is, like, I don't know, from this and she all sex bit, sex, fuck, I can't say the name of that fucking movie. Sex doll she bit. Just put the title is, up so you can is, is, put it again. Who, who? That any time that I see a sex doll getting punted across the room, I fucking laugh. I don't know why, but that is funny to me. Seeing a sex doll just like get kicked or flung across the room, I don't know why. That's funny. That How is often comedy. Do you see sex dolls getting kicked across. Not the often, room? but every time I do, from in these movies do where you, you have do, one and you just kick it across. No, the but I, I would buy one just to kick it across the room and giggle like a little skirl, skirl, girl, girl, skirl, girl. You know, like you would do. You would blow, get one, yeah. blow it up, <laughs> kick it across the room, and giggle like fucking <laughs> beavers. <and stuff. laughs> Okay, but anyway, um... You better be wearing that goddamn outfit. <laughs> uh, where were... the shit in your hair, too. I know you don't got any. Oh, yeah, dude. I fucked up. We skipped all kinds of parts. So let's just start that fucking over again, right? So... Did we skip all kinds of parts? Yeah, we kind of did. Yeah, well, it's okay. Because after she stabs him in the arm... So we see that again. Oh, well, yeah, right. She right. pulls it out. He runs. She fucking chokes him. Well, she picked him up like Jason would. You know, she has suddenly has superhuman strength. And then slowly fucking cocks back and breaks his fucking nose. And he's sitting there watching this happen all the time. And I'm like, dude, defend yourself. This is worse than when Batman got shocked in the nuts by a fucking meth head. And she says this. You're pretty no more. <laughs> and everybody's wondering, like, what the fuck is he talking about? Death of Batman? There you go. <laughs> well, we have to put it in the bottom or just and, and, uh, something. Well, there's the thumbnail. Thank you. Go so, anyway, yes, now is whenever he backhands her and I laugh like a little schoolgirl. <laughs> <laughs> you got me doing it, <laughs> uh, dude, you don't even want to know the Japanese rabbit holes I've been falling down, I can dude. imagine. My Discord people know. You like that shit. I love Japanese, dude. <laughs> 
you like I love Japan. Japan. I would like the to. weird, weird part of that. Yes! Tentacle ass. No, 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 no. I'm not into like any fucking head tire and that creepy anime cord stuff, but dude, I just love the bizarreness, dude. <laughs> That would be the one place I would actually want to go. That in the UK, but I would go to Japan first in a fucking heartbeat. That would be, dude, it'd be fucking <laughs> fun. Yeah. Yeah, but anyway, yeah. we need to get back to this. We ain't never gonna get there. Though. Oh, fuck no. Goddamn, dude, I'm not even gonna get to goddamn <laughs> Ohio anytime in the near future. Like, my God. <laughs> He's gonna make enough money to I'm like, I'm like an hour from the border of Ohio, and I ain't gonna be making it to Ohio anytime in the That's how we'll judge how much money we make from like this. We like if we could make it to Ohio, <laughs> you know what I mean? It's like, hey, we made it to Ohio. Like, so we enough that we could make it to like. Possibly West Virginia. Anyway, he fucking runs out while trying to put pants on and fucking biffs it. Yeah, he put no drawers on, of course. I don't know why you take time to do that. Yeah, but so he runs down the steps and hides in like a closet or another room. So yeah, this is a lesson, you know what I mean? If you have a sex doll, be kind to it. Yeah. You know what I mean? You know, it's a kick it across the floor and there's no reason to tie it up unless you Yeah, dude, it's like, instead of just, like, dirty, rough fucking your sex doll, make love to it every once in a yeah, while. Yeah, maybe soft, sensual love to your sex doll. Yeah. You know, unless, like, you know, fucking an inner tube doesn't feel like, you know, it's up to your, you know, I don't but know. But I mean, still, every once in a while, I'm sure your sex doll would appreciate it if you fucking, you know, fucked her gently, in the words of Tenacious D. So you get, like, those, those ones that are... Crazy looking animals. Like the, the real looking ones. Those, yeah, the yeah, real dolls or whatever. Dolls, Dude, yeah. do you see the. Damn it, how how are we just saying fuck? We're just fuck this episode. Well, I mean, at least, we're, at least we're sticking in the realm of sex dolls. But those, dude, those people that take their real dolls out into real life with them and stuff, that motherfuckers are fucked up. Okay, like I'm And they're I'm all not, old, fat, white people. I'm not recommending that at all to anybody. Don't yeah. do that. Because you're just going to freak people out. I'm like, but yeah, but you know, you plop her out of the closet. Well, that's even Dude, those things are hundreds of pounds, dude. you got to, like, keep those things on a fucking chair to move them around, I guess. I wouldn't, yeah, I guess it would yeah, it'd be rude to keep it in the closet. I've I've seen, yeah, I've seen documentaries of people that own those things. Dude, and, like, they, I, treat I've them never like met anybody that has one, but I think... I've never walk, met one, but I've seen no, a documentary about people that walk, own them. You walked in, you're like, oh, hi, Sarah, how are you today? You know, how's she feeling, Bob? You know, you have to talk like, to her. Like, ask her. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. oh. How are you today? So anyway, anyway, back to this sex doll, right? He's hiding, like I said, and then she's like creeping around with her little feetsies going. <laughs> singing that Twilight set. Bob, Astro smashed my asshole. <laughs> so whatever. She's oh, shit. Uh, they, do they talk? No, they don't talk. Oh, fuck, man. I'm sure you can so make great. one talk. Happy birthday, Polly. Happy birthday, Polly. Happy birthday, Polly. Happy birthday, Polly. Speaking of my butt. Oh, God. <laughs> I was making say it every time. Well, dude, you could make it, like, if they were able to make that robot be like, Not the stick hey. in the butt part. But like, if they were able to make fucking Polly's robot be all sexy at the end. Thanks, honey. You're welcome. It's a nice song. It's my favorite. You're the greatest. See you, sport. See you. Polly, who taught her to talk like that? She loves me. You know, hi, you Polly. You would fuck Polly's robot. But I was saying, if, if they could do that, they could make it so the real dolls aren't going, happy <laughs> birthday, Polly, to get in my butt. Yeah, but like, <laughs> what you're saying is that you would probably fuck, you want to fuck Polly's You're right, robot. I do, dude. There is nothing sexier than Polly's fucking robots. Look at that. Uh, I mean, dude, yeah. I would titty fuck the shit out of that fucking robot. She's, she moves... Smoothly, you know what I mean? Maybe that's what attracts you the most. So anyway, yeah. did I say that she finds him by, like, falling onto the fucking ground and being all creepy? Yeah, dude, that was great. Honey, I'm home. You know, and of course she did the, like, here's Johnny or some shit. But then, yeah. yeah. He runs back to the apartment and tries to use the phone, but she hangs that shit up. E.T. phone home. Grabs the cord and starts straggling him. Right. So they tussle forever, and he's just bang on the thing. Know, bang! Yeah, like, bang! Yeah, like the air coming out. And then, like, oh, yeah, shit. she's creepy some more. Oh, 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 oh,
chakra. He hits her with the fucking phone and she all gets like possessed, like cum is pouring out of her. Uh, I'm not sure if it's cum. Yeah. But it's probably the collection of cum that he never washed out of her. It's fucking pouring out of her fucking mouth, right? Uh, and she's sitting there being like, fuck me! Fuck me! Fuck me! I know, and he was like, I'm like, oh, good God. Then he got closer to it, I'm like, oh my God, he's going to do it. Well, he reaches down and pulls her plug, and it is fucking great. She's all... And then she gurgles the whole way down. <laughs> I'm like, oh my God! Oh, fuck, dude. She says this. This is foreplay. I'm a dead man. And then fucking dies. And he goes to the window again because no, first time. This is the first time with the window. Oh, this is the first. He goes time. to the window. Right, and right. you see in the background her all blurry, you know. And she starts yeah, yeah, yeah like something's <laughs> blowing her up yeah. or some shit. The evil is blowing her. And up. then she disappears. <sighs> she pops down from the ceiling and says this. You're not too smart. I like that little man. With one eyeball, fuck that. Yeah, just, oh man, it's it's great. I that fucking love it. creepy, dude. The one eyeball Jack looking? Yeah, dude. dude. creepy as balls. Definitely want to meet this doll anywhere. Says some more shit. <sighs> dude, if I ever do see a sex doll, I'm going to be looking at it all crooked eyed and shit now. Like, <laughs> oh, yeah. And then like, she I think they'll move, does it? And then she bites his fucking face. Right. Did you fuck my wife? <laughs> He's already screaming with blood. He looks like Christ. He looks like fucking uh, uh, Dib 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 Bruce Willis from the uh, 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 My brain is fried today. Uh, die Hard. <laughs> die, die, die Hard. Die, 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 die Hard. The Vengeance one. You know? Yeah. The oh action. yeah. Yeah. We had his fucking. He had the thing in his shoulder and shit. Yeah. And he was on that boat and shit. He took his his uh, his. Uh, <laughs> I almost said onesie. <laughs> <laughs> He took his shirt and was like, <laughs> and I'm like, that didn't do anything. Your face is still covered, bro. Oh, so anyway, what was I talking about? Oh yeah, oh yeah. Now she's about Bruce Willis in a one. Now she's tied him to the table, and she says something about like, you know, my God, it's gonna be a bumpy night. Fasten your seatbelts. It's going to be a bumpy night. But not the thing you want to hear whenever you're tied to a table. So blah blah fucky blah. It doesn't matter if she pours gas onto him by saying some shit. That smell, that gasoline smell, it smells like victory. And so, like, she's just about to light his ass up. Man. Is it safe? And he fucking blows it the other way and hits her. Yeah, like, blows, like, like spins and shit. Stuff yeah, right, like, right, right, right. Yeah. Blows it in his mouth, right? Yeah, and then, yeah, she just, like, melts. Ah. Right. So now... He's finally, you know, he, well, at this point, he feels like he's finally done it. He opens up the window goes again, out, goes outside. Shows the neighbors his junk, <laughs> and then uh, he's covered in blood, so... She blap! Yeah! And he fucking flips over the thing, and he's hanging on. And of course, you know, she comes up all fucked up and says some shit. Right? I never went down, Ray. You never got me down, Ray. And then she rips his fucking finger off. She kept bending it back until she finally <laughs> ripped it up. That... Would suck balls. I'm <laughs> yeah. just saying. My fingers hurt the whole fucking time watching that. And then she kicks him in the fucking face and he falls. Right. But he fucking wakes up. And you're like, boo. <laughs> yeah. And then he goes to the kitchen and chugs a whole big ass glass of milk. Dude, he did, man. Like, dude, for he's like, I'm the. He fucking crushed that bill. And then... I was like, he's gonna wet the bed. He goes back to bed, and as he's walking through the door, they focus very heavily on this Alien 3 poster for some fucking reason. Like, heavily. They really liked Alien 3. I there. guess. And, you know, he's in bed. The doll busts the fuck in. Right. And she says this. The bitch is back. You know, the title of the fucking movie. Right, right. And that's it. Yeah. That was the bitch's back. I enjoyed Sex Doll She Bitch way more than this, but this was still fun. This is still fun. And it, yeah. This was creepier. Like, the right, doll was creepier. Because the doll... Creepier. The doll was better looking, I want to say, in Sex Doll She Bitch. Like, it wasn't... Like, its mouth didn't have those, the weird fucking yeah, rubbery yeah, yeah. things, like, you know, that rubs against your dick hanging down. and just It was just weird. Right. So, anyway... 
On that note, for Gunner and Bart, this has been another one of the worst movies on YouTube with sex dolls. Yes, we'll see you next week. Now, we're not going to go on like a sex doll tangent like we did with the Terminator thing, are we? No. Emos and werewolves. Dude, if I could find emo sex doll, uh, I would so fucking do it. I Wait a minute, that sounds it. fucked up. Stop it. If I, if I could find an emo sex doll, I would do it, is what I said. That's not what I meant. If I could find I a movie mean. about an yeah. emo sex doll, I bad. would review it. Ah, fuck that. You already revealed it. I know, because that's out there girl. now. I was right, and it's fake news if you say otherwise. Oh, no, I can still go, I never said that. And then Kevin would be like, I got oh. the clip isolated right here. Kevin, you said that. Kevin can lose And then I'd be like, no, I never fucking said that. That's right. Fake deep, news. Th deep fake. Deep fake. Deep fake. <laughs> Deep fake. <laughs> All right. Oh my ass. So yeah, cigarette and then just do like a fucking live thing, I guess.